Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, His, his sufferings, sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave you us give the us Eucharist the, as the memorial of your suffering and death. death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, I pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, I pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we beseech you, O Lord, your, your grace, grace into our hearts, hearts that, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ your Son was made known by the message of an angel, made by his passion and cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Five Joyful Mysteries The first joyful mystery, the Annunciation. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second joyful mystery, the visitation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third joyful mystery, the birth of Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O, o Holy, Holy Mother of God, God despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, Grant to beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him in splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted, entrusted our, our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your Church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen.
Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this Jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you. Let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all, in the gospel we share with all peoples, by your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today is Monday in the 13th week of Ordinary Time. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Let us approach the Lord with praise and thanksgiving. Let us approach the Lord with praise and thanksgiving. Cry out with joy to the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before Him singing for joy. Let us approach the Lord with praise and thanksgiving. Know that He, the Lord, is God. He made us, we belong to Him. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Let us approach the Lord with praise and thanksgiving. Go within his gates giving thanks. Enter his courts with songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Let us approach the Lord with praise and thanksgiving. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal his merciful love. He is faithful from age to age. Let us approach the Lord with praise and thanksgiving. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us approach the Lord with praise and thanksgiving. Please be seated. I lift up my heart to you, O Lord, and you will hear my morning prayer. To my words give ear, O Lord. Give heed to my groaning. Attend to the sound of my cries, my King and my God. It is you whom I invoke, O Lord. In the morning you hear me. In the morning I offer you my prayer, watching and waiting. You are no God who loves evil. No sinner is your guest. The boastful shall not stand their ground before your face. You hate all who do evil. You destroy all who lie. The deceitful and bloodthirsty man, the Lord detests. But I, through the greatness of your love, have access to your house. I bow down before your holy temple, filled with awe. Lead me, Lord, in your justice, because of those who lie in wait. Make clear your way before me. No truth can be found in their mouths. Their heart is all mischief. Their throat a wide open grave, all honey their speech. All those who put protect, protect shall be glad and ring out their joy. You shelter them in you, they rejoice, those who love your name. 
It is you who bless the just man, Lord. You surround him with favor as with a shield. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We praise your glorious name, O Lord, our God. Blessed may be, O Lord, God of Israel, our Father, from eternity to eternity. Yours, O Lord, are grandeur and power, majesty, splendor, and glory. For all in heaven and on earth is yours. Yours, O Lord, is the sovereignty. You are exalted as head over all. Riches and honor are from you, and you have dominion over all. In your hand are power and might. It is yours to give grandeur and strength to all. Therefore, our God, we give you thanks, and we praise the majesty of your name. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Adore the Lord in his holy court. O give the Lord, you sons of God, give the Lord glory and power. Give the Lord the glory of his name. Adore the Lord in his holy court. The Lord's voice resounding on the waters, the Lord on the immensity of waters, the voice of the Lord full of power, the voice of the Lord full of splendor. The Lord's voice shattering the cedars, the Lord shatters the cedars of Lebanon. He makes Lebanon leap like a calf, and Syrian like a young wild ox. The Lord's voice flashes flames of fire, the Lord's voice shaking the wilderness, the Lord shakes the wilderness of Kadesh, the Lord's voice rending the oak tree and sweeping the forest bare. The God of glory thunders, in his temple they all cry glory. The Lord sat enthroned over the flood, the Lord sits as king forever. The Lord will give strength to his people, the Lord will bless his people with peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God, who through the grace of adoption chooses to be children of light, grant we pray that we may not be wrapped in the darkness of error, but always be seen to stand in the bright lights of truth through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of the prophet Amos. Thus says the Lord, for three crimes of Israel and for four, I will not revoke my words, because they shall the, they sell the just man for silver and the poor man for a pair of sandals. They trample the heads of the weak into the dust of the earth and force the lowly out of the way. Son and father go to the same prostitutes, profaning my holy name. Upon garments taken in pledge, they recline beside any altar, and the wine of those who have been fined, they drink in the house of their God. Yet it was I who destroyed the Amorites before them, who were as tall as the cedars, and as strong as the oak trees. I destroyed their fruit above, and their roots beneath. It was I who brought you up from the land of Egypt and who led you through the desert for 40 years to occupy the land of the Amorites. Beware, I will crush you into the ground as a wagon crushes when laden with sheaves. Flight shall perish from the swift, and the strong man shall not retain his strength. The warrior shall not save his life nor the bowman stand his ground, the swift of foot shall not escape, nor the horseman save his life. And the most stout-hearted of warriors shall flee naked on that day, says the Lord. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God.
Remember this, you who never think of God. Remember this, you who never think of God. Why do you recite my statutes and profess my covenant with your mouth, though you hate discipline and cast my words behind you? Remember this, who you never think of God. When you see a thief, you keep peace with him, and with adulterers, you throw in your lords. To your mouth you give free reign of evil. You harness your tongue to deceit. Remember this who you never think of God. You sit speaking against your brother. Against your mother's son you spread rumors. When you do these things, shall I be deaf to it? Or do you think that I am like yourself? I will correct you by drawing them up before your eyes. Remember this, who you never think of God. Consider this, you who forget God, lest I rend you, and there be no one to rescue you. He that offers praise as a sacrifice glorifies me, and to him that goes the right way, I will show the salvation of God. Remember this, who you never think of God. Please stand. Today you hear his voice, harden not your hearts. Spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. When Jesus saw a crowd around him, he gave orders to cross to the other shore. A scribe approached and said to him, Teacher, I will follow you wherever you go. Jesus answered him, Foxes have dens and birds of the sky have nests, but the Son of Man has nowhere to rest his head. Another of his disciples said to him, Lord, let me go first and bury my father. But Jesus answered him, Follow me and let the dead bury the, their dead. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Lahat tayo ay nasa biyaheng langit. At isa lamang ang makapagpa makapagpapadala sa atin sa langit. Walang iba kung di ang ating Panginoong Heso Kristo lamang sapagkat siya ay nanggaling doon, nabuhay doon, at bumalik doon. Walang sino pa man sa atin na ganun ang nangyari. Kaya walang isa man sa atin ang pwedeng gumabay sa atin patungo sa langit. Si Jesus lang. Bakit katunayan ang langit ay hindi lugar? Ang langit ay pag-ibig. Kung nandoon ang pag-ibig, nandoon ang langit. 
At si Jesus lamang ang makapagtuturo sa atin ng tunay na pag-ibig. Sapagkat ayon nga sa unang liham ni San Juan, ang Diyos ay pag-ibig. Kaya kung nasaan ang pag-ibig, nandoon ang langit. Hindi yan nakukuha sa laki ng bahay. Kahit na yung pinakmaking mansyon sa inyong bayan, ang inyong tinitiran, kung wala naman doon pag-ibig, wala doon ang langit sapagkat hindi mo matatagpuan ng Diyos doon. Sapagkat ang Diyos wala sa gusali, hindi naninirahan sa building. Naninirahan yan sa puso ng tao. Ang Diyos ang nagdadala sa atin sapagkat siya'y nananahanan sa atin. Kaya tayo ang nagdadala ng pag-ibig dito sa simbahang ito. At kaya nandi dito ang pag-ibig, nandi dito si Kristo. Kapag ka wala si Kristo dito at wala tayong pag-ibig sa isa't isa, hukay itong simbahang ito. Ang pag-ibig hindi isang gusali. Kaya huwag yun ang lubhang pagtuunan natin ng pansin. Hindi tayo papasok sa langit sapagkat sabi natin tayo ang pinakamalaking mansyon doon sa ating munisipyo. Hindi mo ba nakikita yung mansyon na yan? Yung angka namin ang nakarating dyan. Kaya nga dito sa ating banal na kasulatan eh, sinabi ng ating Panginoong Yeso Kristo eh, hindi nakukuha yan sa bahay. Foxes have dens and the birds of the air have nests, but the Son of Man have nowhere to lay down His head. Siya mismo, sabi niya ganun, walang malaking bahay na ganyan. Hindi mo malaman kung saan nakatira si Jesus. Palipat-lipat. Pero siya ang pag-ibig, kaya nandun ang langit. Aanin ko ang bahay na bato o ang nakatira'y kwago. Mainam pa yung bahay na kubo o ang nakatira'y tao. Kaya isipin ninyo, doon ba sa malaking bahay ninyo, kahit punong-puno ng kasangkapan, mga tao bang nag-iibigan sa isa't isa ang nakatira? Sapakat doon, natututo ang tao kung paano umibig sapakat nando doon si Jesus, ang maestro ng pag-ibig. Charity begins at home. Yung pag-ibig natututunan sa bahay. Hindi bahay yan natirahan. Bahay yan natahanan. Yung bahay na tirahan, nakakaduda yan. Yung mga tao dyan, away ng away, tirahan ng tirahan. Yung bahay na tahanan, kaya tinawag na tahanan, sapagkat kahit na may kalungkutan, may pumapahid ng luha mo, kaya nga ang tawag ay tahanan. Home sweet home. Pinapahid yung pawis mo, pinapahid yung luha mo. Kung may kalungkutan ka, suliranin ka, nandu doon yung mga umiibig sa iyo, nagagabay sa iyo, kaya tahan na. Tahan na. Doon ka makakatagpo ng mga tao, magpapatahan sa iyo, hindi yung magpapaluha sa iyo. Charity begins at home. Kaya lang, hindi ka rin sigurado kung sa bahay natin, eh matututo tayong umibig sapagkat nando doon si Kristo. Bakit? Sapagkat wala rin pag-ibig nga doon sa bahay. Yung mga tao sa bahay makasarili. Yung pamilya makasarili. 
Walang ginawa kung hindi maghanap ng kanilang kaginhawahan, kayamanan, kapangyarihan. Sa kanila lang pamilya, maramot, sakim na pamilya. Yun ang naituturo. Mga anak ha, pamilya ha, pamilya, pamilya, pamilya. Wala tayong pakialam sa iba. Charity begins at home, but it does not end there. E may mga pamilya, ganun na nangyari. Ang pag-ibig daw, nagsimula doon sa bahay, pero doon din nagtapos. Binakuran yung pamilya. Binakuran yung kayamanan nila. Binakuran yung kapangyarihan nila. Hindi binahagi doon sa mga taong nangangailangan. Maramot. Yun lang kanilang apelido ang gustong maghari dito sa mundo. Sila lang. Kaya sino may ari ng bayan? Uyo. Halimbawa lang to ha. Gagamit ako na apelido, maaring hindi yun nga. Kanino ba? Sino ba rito? Isa lang ang kilala. Ay, ang pamilyang Suarez. Ay, ang pamilyang Mercado. Ay, ang pamilyang Mendoza. Yun lang. Yung iba hindi kilala. Wala eh. Bakit walang kayamanan, walang kapangyarihan? Sila lang ang may kayamanan, sila lang ang may kapangyarihan. Binakuran. Charity begins at home and it ends there. Kaya ang ugali nila, parang sila lang ang mga anak ng Diyos. Sila lang. Sila lang ang ginagalang, sila lang ang pinagsisilbihan. Sa simbahan, hindi ganyan, ha? Kahit ano apelido nyo, tinatanggap kayo, no? Kahit ano pangalan nyo, kahit ang pangalan nyo, eh, indyo na indyo, di magiba, di makilala, Di maamoy. Mga ganyan ba mga pangalan na hindi pinagtatawanan? Hindi na tinatanong dito sa simbahan. Kayo ba nung pumasok dito sa basilika, tinanong pa kayo, kanino kayong anak? Sino tatay niyo? Sino nanay niyo? At pag kayo, we, galing lang sa mga pamilyang hindi kalala, doon kayo sa dulo. Oh. Pag kayo eh, anak ng mga taong nasa alta sa siyudad, diyan kayo sa, yan, may reserve na po diyang upuan. Wala oh. Ibig sabihin ng Diyos, ang malahat ng tao. Kaya nga dito, pagpasok nyo, ang tawagan sa lahat, kapatid. Kaysa kayo Amerikano, kaysa kayo eh, Australiano, kaysa kayo eh, Romano, Italiano, kaysa kayo Ita, Igurot. Pagpasok nyo dito, kapatid. Hindi sinisino. Kaya dito, sabi ng ating Panginoon Iso Kristo, may lumapit sa Kanya, o... Oh. Sabi nga nun, gusto ko pong sumunod sa inyo pero meron pa akong mga asunto sa pamilya. Ginawang dahilan yung pamilya niya. Tayo ganyan, ha? ginagamit natin yung pamilya natin bilang excuse. Pati sa kasamaan, ginagawa natin excuse. Bakit ka nangungotong kung ikaw yung nasa pamahalaan? Bakit ka nangungutong? Para po sa pamilya ko. Para ba pag sinabi mo para sa pamilya, okay na yun. Minsan nga sinisisi natin yung asawa natin. Wala kang kautak-utak. 
tingnan mo yung ating kapitbahay o oh, nagtatrabaho sa ganyan, sa gobyerno, mayaman na, eh pangkaraniwan lang, ano yan, empleyado, pero ngayon nakapagpagawa ng bahay, ikaw o, oh, Ikaw ang pinuno ng ahensya hanggang ngayon, nandito, o, oh, nasa apartment pa lang tayo. E paano, tapat yung asawa nyo, hindi kumukuha ng suhol. Sinisisi nyo pa, wala kang utak, hindi katulad na itong, ano mo, hindi, hindi mo ba, hindi mo ba, naalagaan ang pamilya mo? Ayun, ginagawang dahilan yung pamilya para gumawa ng kabalbalan. Kaya sabi na ating Panginoon sa Kristo, ay lako, hindi mo pwedeng gawing papilyan ha para makapasok sa langit. Ako, pagpasok ko sa langit, ano, sasabihin ko sa Panginoon, ba't ka papasok dito? Ang kan ako ng mga Gonzales. Pwede ko bang sabihin sa Panginoon niyo? Kilalin niyo ba mga Gonzales? Charity begins at home. It does not end there. Kaya pagpasok nyo sa simbahan, sana maalala nyo yan. Pagdating dito, isa lang ang tawagan. Mga kapatid, hindi lang yung pamilya ko ng pamilya Gonzales ang mga anak ng Diyos. We all stand to profess and offer our prayers for every intention we are going to say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the leaders of the church and all those engaged in preaching the word of God may persevere in their commitment to follow Christ. We pray. Lord, Lord, hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That our community may be renewed from day to day through faith in the Word of God, calling them to a better life. We pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That those of us who have lost hope because of our sins may realize that Christ, our leader, walks with us and carries our burden. We pray. Lord, Lord, hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That those who are weakened by sickness or infirmity may be assured of God's comfort through the care and support of their families. We pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For our brothers in ministry at Santo Domingo and Our Lady of the Rosary, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. For the intentions of these Mass, the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions. We pray. Lord, hear our prayer. That the dead who follow Jesus may enter God's presence forever in heaven. We pray. Lord, hear our prayer. Almighty Father, grant us the wisdom to learn that we are all your children and therefore that we must treat one another as true brothers and sisters. We ask you this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, through your goodness we have this bread to offer which earth has given. Human hands have made, this will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever.
Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this wine to offer. Fruit of the divine works of human hands, this will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. O God, who graciously accomplished the effects of your mysteries, grant, we pray, that the deeds by which we serve you may be worthy of the sacred gifts through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your heart. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For just as through your beloved Son you created the human race, so also through him with great goodness you formed it anew. And so it is right that all your creatures serve you, and all the redeemed praise you, and all your saints with one heart bless you. Therefore we too extol you with all the angels, as in joyful celebration we acclaim. Indeed, holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness, make holy therefore these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Their 
Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francisca, our Pope, Socrates, our Bishop, Pidelis, our Auxiliary Bishop, Gerard, the Master of the Order of Preachers and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, her beloved spouse, with the Blessed Apostle, Saint Dominic and Saint Francis, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Jesus loves us, and in his love for us, he taught us to call his own Father, our Father, so we have the courage to say, Our Father, who, who art, art in, in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name. name. Thy, thy kingdom, kingdom come, thy will, will be done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And, and lead us not into temptation, temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold, this is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this communion. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Please kneel for the prayer for the families. Heavenly Father, we come before you to praise you and to thank you for the great gift of the family. We pray to you for all families consecrated by the sacrament of matrimony. May they discover each day the grace they have received as small domestic churches. May they know how to witness to your presence and to the love with which Christ loves the church. We pray to you for all families faced with difficulty and suffering caused by illness or circumstances of which only you know. Sustain them and make them aware of the path to holiness upon which you call them so that they might experience your infinite mercy and find new ways to grow in love. We pray to you, your children and your people. May they encounter you and respond joyfully to the vocation you have in mind and for them. We pray for parents and grandparents. May they be aware that they are signs of the fatherhood and motherhood of God in caring for the children who, in body and spirit, you entrusted to them for the experience of fraternity that the family can give to the world. Lord, grant that each family might live their specific vocation to holiness in the church as a call to become missionary dis disciples in the service of life and peace, in communion with our priest, religious, and all vocations in the church. Bless the world meeting of families. Amen. Please stand. Blessed be the Lord our God. Yes. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us the mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our Father and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Blessed, Blessed be, be the, the Lord, Lord our God. God. Let us pray. O God, who graciously accomplished the effects of your mysteries, grant, we pray, that the deeds by which we serve you may be worthy of the sacred gifts through Christ our Lord. Amen. Kami po ito ang pusong nagpapasalamat sa inyong lahat sa pakikiisa sa amin sa pagdiriwang ng Santa Eucharistia na way pagpatuloy po ninyo ang pagdarasal para sa aming mga naglilingkod sa inyo dito sa Basilica Minore of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawag. Makakaasa kayong magpapatuloy din kami sa pagdarasal para sa inyo at sa inyong mga minamahal sa buhay. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Let us go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Now please join us as we have the prayer for the blessing of the sick and followed by the prayer for the blessing of rosaries and other religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. God, our almighty Father, by your blessing you give us strength to support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick and aging brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness. Restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord.
Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may these rosaries, images, candles, oil, and other religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.